Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to the AI Playbook. Today we're going to be talking about an extension that's going to make your YouTube experience improve a lot. It's called YouTube Summary with ChatGPT. It's a creation of Blast.co. You can explore also other extensions, but we will be covering them in our next videos as well. So stay tuned for that. And let's move on right into what this extension does and how we can make the most out of it. First off, let's discuss what this extension does. YouTube Summary with ChatGPT is an extension that summarizes the content of a whole video and presents it to you in an easy to read format so that you don't have to watch the whole thing. And it has many, many benefits that you can take advantage of and we're going to see them in the end of the video. So let's dive in on how to install this extension and how to use it. The first thing we need to do is go into Chrome Web Store where we're going to have the extension installed. You can look up YouTube summary with ChatGPT, as you can see in my screen, and you will just add to Chrome, add extension, and we just wait until the extension is added to our Google Chrome session. So here it's already done. So if we go on YouTube, we are going to now have this option that's transcript and summary, and we can click on it. In this case, we are looking at a Mark Zuckerberg speech, and we're going to have the English transcript made automatically for us. And if we click on the view AI summary, open new tab, we're going to have a chat GPT tab that's going to summarize the video we are looking at. It's interesting to tell you that um, the summarize tool works much better in shorter videos. And if you have like a one hour or two hour video, uh, for example, of an interview, it's not going to work at its best because it's, it might let lots of idea ideas out of the summary because it's a really, really short summary. But for maybe eight to 20 minute videos, this can be an absolute killer tool because you're going to be able to summarize the important ideas and the key points um, in a really easy to read summary and not having to see the, the whole video. And it is also interesting to know that if, we, if you click on the settings button, you're going to open the, the settings, let's say, and you can change and customize the prompt, the prompt for summary. This is what the um, extension sends to the chat GPT in order to get a, a summary. In this case, instead of putting or in, of the input being summarize the following, we can have it to be anything else. So that's interesting and we can play with it. Uh, but something I, I consider important for you to know. I really think this tool is really useful as you can see, but we can also go over some benefits and some ways in which you could use YouTube summary with ChatGPT. In the first place, I think learning is going to be like the best use case for this uh, extension because you're going to be able to summarize lots of information into really easy to, to read summaries. So that's a um, very good application this can have. But also if you are like a business owner or, for, or an entrepreneur or want to use AI for your own business, you can consider this as a tool for training, for example, in the case that you have produced different videos for your employees to watch in case they are recently onboarding. You can make them a summary, like a transcript, and then the summary um, for them to have and for them to be able to go to when they have any doubt and not having to see the whole video again. So that's something useful that you can take advantage as well. And also this can help you a lot if you're going, if you're trying to make like an effective time management strategy as you're going to be able able to summarize the key points and the key ideas of any video uh, in a really, really short time. So that's also something useful. And last but not least, you should consider that this summary or this transcript can also be thrown as an input to ChatGPT on its whole, and you can make lots of things out of it as well. The prompt doesn't always need to be summarized. You can do different things. So explore it, um, take a look at it, install it, and make the most out of it. Also, if you have like any new applications or considerations that I have haven't talked about, leave it in the comments. That's always useful for us to grow the community and to share the knowledge. And well, that's it. YouTube Summary with ChatGPT is a useful tool. I think you should install it, maybe have it there. And you know, if you want to use it, you can use it. Um, also, if you want to make the most out of AI and introduce it into your own processes and your own company, you can email us to the email address I'm going to leave down here and we can have a chat about it. And well, we'll see you in the next video.